Oh, hi, everybody. Look at these butterflies I made. I made them with some paint and they are perfectly symmetrical on either side. Symmetrical means the same on both sides. And they're all different, but they're symmetrical. I'll show you how I did it. All you need is some paper and some paint. I have a couple different colors here. Purple, orange, blue, and yellow. There we go. And to start, we take our piece of paper and we have to fold it in half. Line up the edges as best you can and then push them down to make a crease, like a little book. And we'll open it up. And this is going to be the middle of our butterfly. So one half is going to be the exact same as the other half. And I'll show you how we do it. We're gonna add some paint only to one half of the page. How about some yellow? You can just make kind of a mess here. However you like, you can add some dots. That was a lot of paint. How about some purple? I'm gonna make some little lines with the purple. There we go. And finally, some orange. Got some dots of orange. And maybe one big line. Whoosh. All right, I think this is gonna look great. Now we fold our paper back over on that same line we made before. And then push down, push down nice and hard. Now some paint might squeeze out and you can just dab it up with a cloth. It's all right. Then we'll open it back up and see our butterfly. Here we go. Whoa, look at that. Beautiful. And it's the exact same on both sides. The paint we put on one side stamped onto the other side the exact same way. Now we can finish up our butterfly once this is dry. So we'll put it aside for now. And you can see I made some other ones earlier and they're all different, but they're symmetrical. Same on each side. I'll pick one to make our finished butterfly with. How about, maybe I'll use this one right here. This one's got lots of different colors on it. So once it's dry, we can fold it back up like this. And I'm going to use a little pencil crayon. You can use a pencil to draw half of a butterfly's wing like this. Kind of looks like the top of a heart, doesn't it? Then we'll use some scissors to cut along the line. It doesn't have to be perfect, because it's still gonna be symmetrical on the inside. And that's the important part. All the way around. There we go. Put this aside. Let's open it up and see. Very nice. I love all those colors, the yellow and the blue and the red. Then I made a butterfly body with just some black construction paper. I folded that in half too and cut out a butterfly shape. Then I took two pieces of black construction paper and cut them really thin, glued them on and just curled the ends with a pencil. And that's gonna be our butterfly body right here. We'll use a little bit of glue to glue it on. I think it's gonna be really pretty. Get all around. And on it goes to complete our perfectly symmetrical butterfly wings. Look at that. So nice. Hello, butterfly. You can try this at home. Your butterfly wings will be different than mine, but they'll be perfectly symmetrical. Make sure to share it on social media and use the hashtag Katie's Classroom so I can see what you made. I can't wait to see what your butterfly looks like.
Bye-bye, butterfly.